video how to integrate google receptor to your form uh, let's get started how to do it quickly with object submission so usually everybody knows what is google receptor is and there is a document to how to integrate this version 3 so they clearly mention what are the things you need to do to get the integrate the google receptor to your forms so let's get started so in here they mention you need to call apis so this is the form that i'm going to use in the tutorial so this is the code right now so i have created my form here and uh, i place the js files down below uh, api js file and this is for ajax submission so the form is going to submit using ajax so once you copy those two things and this is your form here at the button you need to place your data side key so side key can be generated using google chapter admin console i will teach it how to do it in next episode uh, hopefully everybody knows how to do that thing so once you place the side key here you need to create a script function that means javascript function so this is the form id so in here no need any submission or anything form only the id means here so once the form is submitted this code will execute it so it will goes to mail function and the mail.php you will have to create the site secret key here and uh, all the google chapter validations will run and if success the mail goes to the relevant email ai fails it shows validation required okay uh, and in the front line that means in the form you just need to create the form id and the javascript files here and then the button right key so i have placed all the codes in the down description below you can download it from the description area and this is the function here and uh, in the side menu you have to create this thing the form will work perfectly but once you run it in the local host it will give you an error like uh, like this at the same time you have to place the forms in the server now it, it's working perfectly that's all guy uh, from this menu and uh, if you want to see how to do the admin console part so you can create admin console create a sample menu click version 3 capta and domain name accept the terms and condition and submit so then they will show you the site key and the security key so you can show it use those things to develop your google e chapter validation in your forms thank you